three, two, one, zero. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. Hey everybody, and welcome back to Mission Control for a quick tips video. In this video, we're going to discuss the video multi-view workspace. The video multi-view workspace, though intended for use with Synergy and seeing your layer previews, also works with any other NDI stream on the network. You can use this to view a camera or, say, power pre presentation from another computer on the console. They would need to be on the same network with the console, and it's not recommended to have more than four or five streams on a gigabit network, even though if you're also using that for TitanNet, ArtNet, or streaming ACN on the same network. So let's take a look-see at that. Here I've got the Titan Go interface up on version 13, and I have some NDI uh, streams on the same network as this computer. So if I was to click the uh, plus button here, I can see all the different streams on the network. And that one doesn't seem to want to be coming up, including one of them is uh, the full version of Capture. So if I was to select that, I can see here the full version of Capture on my NDI streams. We can also pick different ones to put here. I can select this one to put it there. I can select uh, this one to put there. I could select oh, this one to put there. Uh, so this is a little funky because I'm streaming NDI out of the console as well as in, and my network's getting a little on the flooded side because of it. As you see here, if we go into the uh, context menu, we can change the layouts of it to be just a one screen or multiple screens. Uh, in any configuration we want. So that's using the video multi-view workspace uh, with other NDI streams other than just from Synergy and AI. I hope you learned something. Please subscribe and join us next time. Thanks. Bye. Wheel stop. Roger, wheel stop, Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.